catastrophic winds reaching 1,000 miles per hour would instantly obliterate everything on Earth's surface if our planet stopped spinning overnight. I used to think the worst thing about Earth stopping would be the darkness, but after diving deep into the physics, I realized we'd all be dead within minutes from something completely different. Let me walk you through what would actually happen. The moment Earth stops, you and everything else would keep moving at the same speed the planet was spinning. That's roughly 1,000 miles per hour at the equator. Imagine being launched from a cannon while everything around you becomes a deadly projectile. Buildings, cars, oceans, even the atmosphere would become supersonic missiles. But here's where it gets really wild. The oceans wouldn't just slosh around, they'd completely relocate. All that water would rush toward the poles due to centrifugal force disappearing. We'd have two massive polar oceans and a giant ring of exposed seafloor around the equator. The Atlantic and Pacific as we know them would vanish. The weather patterns would be absolutely insane. Without the Coriolis effect from Earth's rotation, hurricanes and tornadoes couldn't form the way they do now. Instead, we get these bizarre straight-line wind patterns flowing directly from hot to cold regions. And here's the part that blew my mind. One side of Earth would face the sun for six months while the other side froze in darkness. The sunny side would reach temperatures hot enough to boil water, while the dark side would become colder than Antarctica. The magnetic field generated by our spinning core would weaken dramatically, leaving us exposed to deadly solar radiation. Even if somehow we survived the initial catastrophe, the long-term effects would make Earth completely uninhabitable. So next time you're having a bad day, just remember that at least our planet is still spinning at exactly the right speed to keep us all alive.